We are at the Reillusion Re booth, excuse me, with John at Sigraf. We're having an awesome time here so far. Um, there is something going on behind you that is quite interesting. Um, can you explain what James is doing over there as well as what this has to do with iClone 7? Absolutely. So this is real time uh, motion capture in iClone. And what's great about it is that it's a dual stream face and body using a single workstation, a common gaming system. Wow. So we're really democratizing motion capture. We're doing that with, with our partners, XSense and Faceware, right. which we have coupled uh, collabor collaboration on technology and developed a plugin so that anyone can really adapt this technology for real-time facial capture, real-time facial and body dual capture, and do that all in a package that can fit any size studio, any size budget. So democratizing, meaning now just a user at home could do it for a hobbyist type of project or a big studio could use it for their more large scale project. Right, that's exactly it. And that's the spirit of our software. So we're delivering uh, really industry standard uh, technologies and, and uh, tearing the wall down so that others, really creative minds of all budgets and skill levels and uh, creative aspiration can, can harness these tools and bring them into their production. Yes. So we're seeing media created from every level, from YouTube all the way up to short films yeah. that are making you know, buzz and, and film festivals and even getting, you know, accolades and cans and then all of a sudden there's a, a new director born out of ah. some great visual effects that may have may have started at home. Um, you know, most of our great sci-fi guys did just that with, yeah. you know, with uh, early film. Yeah. This is really just the, the next era for that. So right. now we're bringing this kind of motion capture creation for game developers of, uh, you know, small teams, yeah. also filmmakers, yeah. um, really anyone that wants to visualize an idea. Um, iClone is a total vir virtual production studio. It's designed for anyone. That's fantastic. So what kind of application could a an individual experience and use it for in comparison to a studio? If you can offer some examples. Right, so inside iClone we have really developed a complete platform for you to develop characters. If you're not a modeler, you can access characters and, and develop your own custom nice. designs with easy custom morphs. Nice. Then you can add your own textures. We have a complete real-time environment, so we take care of really nice visuals already in the box for you. Great. You just need to bring in lights and associate that. So for uh, for a a startup, um, you know, personal projects yeah. or an indie, uh, you really have a, an entire studio's worth of knowledge and, and tools that are already pre-designed, which in some packages, they're, you're going to need to have help from coders or other personnel to really get your project off the ground. iClone yeah. offers everything in a box and then allowing partners like Xsense and Faceware to utilize our open device architecture, we really can bring in professional quality capture tools into this real-time environment and then just just make the entire platform accessible for everyone. Excellent. For studios, it really, it really quickens things. So studios are always looking to you know, how do we save budget? How do we save on time? How do we save on on production yeah. you know, power? How can we be more collaborative in the studio? How can we bring in writers, directors, actors? Let let the director of photography, the director, and the writers all look at not just dailies but real time. Yeah. You know, production and say, move this light, move this set piece, yeah. and then use virtual cameras. This is a total, this is a total solution for them already ready out of the box, so yeah. that studios can really use real time production, use the tools that they're already used to, accents and faceware, right. and incorporate it all in one box. Completely streamlines their process. Yes, I love it, and it's really fascinating watching James do these demos right now and seeing the the real-time right. reaction on screen even with the face down to the facial movements down to the body movements that's that's really wonderful right. um, I want to hear I, I'm just curious to know how this is already being used sure. um, you've spoken so much about how adaptable it is across the board for different projects what are some of these projects how right. have people used it right so just recently we worked with uh, Lotus Entertainment on Keanu Reeves's production of replicas and we incorporated uh, full body capture and Inside iClone, where we did, uh, we took the boards and did a complete animatic. What normally takes a, a team of people was a couple of us with iClone, real time capture tools, and motion capture technology that we were able to just 
put Keanu directly inside. Wow. So uh, we, you know, we had great uh, resource data that we could use. Um, and then be able to visualize everything in real time. We worked in concert with the director, the director of photography, the props guys, and the and on the stunt people as well for um, a live action sequence to visualize a, a physical a physical stunt. Yeah. Um, the thing is, is that everyone saved time. We got everything ready and done. Yeah. Twenty five shot sequence out of that uh, for Icon. So um, James also did all of the motion capture. For that, nice. so um, there is a uh, a particular uh, actor in the in, in there that will require a lot of mocap, and you'll see the movie's called Replicas. Replicas. Yes, and uh, so they did a lot of the motion capture for that, and used that in real time, completely unconventional, totally live on the set, uh, data capture, and everything's being used in post-production now. So total real-time production pipeline um, using really new dynamic unconventional tools, but it's helping studios save time, yeah. money, and it. ultimately, you know, hitting deadlines. Yeah, I love it, this is so cool. Um, and my last question, how do you see it? Because obviously this is already, this is pretty amazing what's happening behind me. Um, how do you see it growing in your ideal world? How would it grow within the coming year or five years? Right. Right, so I think well, you have the you have so many different areas right now of, of screens. You have VR, you have you know the considerations yeah. for AR production. Sure. We are already capable of doing complete 360 video production outside of iClone and renders here. So you can do that sort of thing. But at the same time, I see um, I just see a greater amount of technology being brought into iClone sure. as we've opened it up. So this real time uh, animation engine that's really it's an artistic tool that's prepared for helping characters come to life and scenes be able to animate without necessarily the uh, the, the degree or the, the textbook stack this high yes, yeah. in order as a prerequisite to get involved. I love it. This is really bring your idea and visualize it and, and we're, we're looking to make that easier in the future. All right, so it would be only natural to then talk to uh, Stephanie of XMs and Peter of Facewear as this is very much something that you're involved with as well. <laughs> so if you can please speak to our users a little bit about your involvement in regards to the body mocap and the facial mocap. Um, what has this process been like for you? What are you, what kinds of things are you seeing from it? Sure, well at Xsense uh, just recently we've really been making strides to make our technology more accessible to yeah. the indie creatives, to bridge the gap between production quality data and uh, smaller studios or independent creatives who want access to that. And so earlier this year, we actually launched an indie program to significantly bring down our entry cost. And so this integration with iClone was perfect because now it provides the platform giving full accessibility to not just the tools, but also um, the platform to you know create your scenes, actually utilize their characters. Great. And together with Facebook, which we've been working with for quite some time now, yeah. it's the perfect complete solution, face, body, and I clone together. It's a great marriage, especially for the indie community. I love it. That's wonderful. Yeah, for us, uh, I mean, animating lip sync is, is always a very hard thing. That's kind of what our specialty has been for years and years and years. And what we really like about iClone is it's a complete solution, right? And we can fit in there. And we have um, the capability with some of our new technology to do real-time capture. So anybody that hasn't done this before can just basically kind of point and shoot, record directly into iClone, and they have a really nice editing workflow uh, to kind of polish the animation and look at good, look, make it look good. Because it is a very hard thing that you're trying to do to create animation, and especially if you're creating any sort of volume or a lot of animation. You know, indie teams don't have all the resources in the world, so what we're excited about is the ability to kind of make that more accessible and wider spread with the, uh, the built-in iClone user base already. That's fantastic, and I'm very curious to know now who got in touch with who first in regards to this whole collaboration. <laughs> I think, I think uh, the Reillusion the guys, Re they were the ones guys. who set the first date. That's We've been talking with them for yeah. quite a while. Yeah. Uh, we were just talking at uh, Seagraph last year yeah. it was when the talks kind of began, and we took off running from there, and now here we are. We're cool. happy to announce it. Yeah. Yep. It's great. Very exciting. Yeah, it was about a year ago when we started this, so cool. it's kind of fun to see this whole full circle oh, yeah. and out in the open now. I and can't more, wait. Even more excited to see people using it. Yeah. yeah. I know. I was just going to say I can't wait to see how it takes the industry. And I'm sure it'll have a huge impact. So yeah. thank you both.